London, financial capital of the world, historical, majestical. Living alongside the pulsating organs of commerce is the throbbing heart of world theatre. The West End is home to at least five theatres. And the Trafalgar Studios, home to the West End debut of actress Fanula Franks, an ambitious rising star facing the tough and uncompromising road to fame. An actress prepares. Young, gifted and bright and battling first night nerves, actress Fanula Franks takes a deep breath before treading the boards. I think, if I'm honest, um, some people are, are just born uh, great. Um, some achieve greatness and some have greatness thrust upon them. Mm. Twelfth um, night. born great and mm. I also have great greatness thrust upon me as well. Mm. Um, have you ever achieved uh, greatness? Well on stage and okay. uh, in my life yeah every day actually so yeah yeah. Mm. A world-class performance needs world-class support from a dedicated backstage staff. So uh, how long have you two been working together? Oh my gosh, mm. is this our second job together? I think it might be. Yeah, mm. I was doing her first job and we hit it off, you know, didn't we? We would always be the last ones out having a drink. We got in trouble a bit with me for drinking. Yeah. I do. yeah, yeah. I'm Graham, I'm the stylist here at the Trafalgar Studios. I've been working in the West End for a few years. <laughs> I don't believe in astrology or anything, but I do believe in hair and mm. in the sense that you know you become intimate with somebody's head and you know so many parts I mean how many parts of someone's body do you a lover for instance or a family member do you ever get to know hands back legs mm the parts but with hair you've got I mean look this is one part of her hair this is a 200th of her hair and this is I mean I know thousands of bits of you yeah. each strand of hair and yes. each strand of hair has a different personality incredibly so in many ways I know you better than most of the cast mm. yeah I would agree actually yeah mm. yeah I would agree yeah right so when are we ready okay Hi, hi, I'm Jimmy Evans, and I'm one of the actors in the show. Fuck off! So, Jimmy, I'm just going to ask you a few questions. Um, yeah. About the play, about your relationship, about your <coughs> life as an actor. Okay. Okay. Uh, how are you enjoying working in this production? Yeah, it's really good. I'm really enjoying it. Um, how are you getting on with Fanny? Fanny. She's obviously... Uh, you know, people saying she's destined for a big thing. So, you're <laughs> destined. yeah, no, she is. She's destined to, destined for big things, definitely. I think she's got a wonderful future ahead of her. I really enjoy working with her. Um, she's a really good actress. Um, yeah. Okay. For me, the, the process is very important. You know, I'm an actor. It's my profession, and I take it very seriously. And I think what a lot of people don't realise is the amount of work that goes into the process. Um, so I normally come in sort of about three hours before the show begins and um, start my warm up. And it's a series of vocal exercises. Um, I'm very physical um, and uh, I do some lunging some screaming, some just channeling my energy. How, how are you finding uh, working with, with Fanny? Fanny? Yeah, Fanny, hi. Can I just have a quick word about the um, scene where I'm talking about my husband's death? Yeah, 
Yeah. What, what happened in that? I don't understand. Did you get well, something you know, When I'm doing the um, big speech and, and, and yeah. crying and... What? what? I should know because you, I... Were you, were you singing? Oh, what? Oh, okay. Um, I just thought that it was a bit... I just felt that... And it's not you, because I, you are really, you're wonderful in that scene, but I just, I felt that it was sort of maybe lacking something. Do you know what I mean? And I just, I thought that maybe a bit of song at the back, you know, while I'm sort of at the back there, <laughs> might... Did right. You not? Because the audience <laughs> reaction was, I think they really, I think they really enjoyed it. Did you not think? Well, she's enthusiastic and ambitious and um, that's a, that's great a great thing to see in someone what well, well no um, no I really didn't think that that it's not really right for the scene is it because it's meant to be really Oh. Sad in that bit. I mean, you it's quite really a sort of dramatic. Upset. Well, I know it's absolutely fine, but we really can't go on with it being like that, can we? Oh, I had, I had no idea that. Well, that's I, fine. That's fine. Can we just not have that? In? I was just, I was just trying to do what I felt that the scene needed. Right. Okay. Well, I'm going to call Trevor. Okay. 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 I mean, you know. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. Sure. It's just about the balance of the scene. It's about the balance of what, what actually is happening, what's happening to the characters, what's happening to the story. Yeah, yeah. Because we've got to think about the story, really, I suppose. Not, not... Yeah, yeah. Not story. fucking singing. Oh, hello. With lemon or without? Uh, I'll go with lemon. No, I'll go with that. I'll go with that. <laughs> Fanny only drinks green tea. And as a special treat today, I've cooked a made of flapjacks for my lovely, lovely Fanny. You've got to feed your Fanny. <laughs> Should be a song in the musical, shouldn't it? You've got to feed your fanny, you've got to feed your fanny, you've got to feed your fanny, or it will starve. Oh, oh fanny dear! <laughs> I hope she likes it. Uh, fanny dear! <laughs> your green tea, madame. And a little special something I cooked up at home. Oh, no, it's really healthy. Honey, oats, pumpkin seeds. Graham, don't be stupid. I'm on a diet of about, you know, two portions of fruit and a salad a day. Oh, God. Sorry, I thought maybe this was fitting with your health, your health thing. No, Graham. God's sake. And I'm out of Morocco. Would you just... Yes, of course. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Baba, baby, baby, baby. Baba, baba, baby. Ha! So, no, it's good as song. Baraka song, the musical. Coming. Mm, looks like shit. It's alright. It'll be fine. Ow! Yeah, well, I spurred myself. Oh god, sorry. Oh god. I didn't pour hot cold water in your. Oh. If you could sum up your relationship with Benuda <sighs> in three words, what would they be? Fun. Graham. Good. Graham. And hair. <laughs> Fun, good hair. Fun, because we have a laugh. Um, I don't, I think we're all part of a team backstage, so there's no egos when it comes to Graham. 
No, it's just that I, when I'm on stage, okay, and something falls apart like that, yeah, I'm, I'm the one who ends up looking like what? shit. Like, oh, just oh, everybody oh, realizes how important their hair is. Okay, she brought eight casting directors with her oh, tonight. God. Okay, and I'm just oh, on the stage, feeling so like a complete prick. Oh, so so sorry. they treat me with a lot of respect. Yeah, I, I don't give a fuck. Well, it's okay? well they're upstairs. I don't give a fuck. So just fix it. And we have a lot of fun. Okay. I'm just hey, I'm I'm fucking pissed off. No out because it's, everything's Is going that on. cunt still filming as well? Just, you know, the fuck is it? Get into your version of that worry about Maria's I don't know. I do She's amazing. She's really amazing. She's one of the best actors I've ever worked with. Her, her talent and her charisma. Mm. Uh, and she's you know, very beautiful. I think she's definitely destined for for really big things. Hmm. Yeah, I do get a lot of cards. I can't normally sort of have them all in the dressing room, but these are my favourites. Um, yeah, one from yeah, Trevor so there. Sort of. Yeah. So is there any uh, any love interests in the, in the show? Yeah. Uh, well, actually, I am. I am sort of seeing someone in in real life, if you will. Um, I'm not really going to talk about it on camera, just because he's quite high profile. Everyone will sort of know him. But um, yeah, in the in the company, um, obviously because I'm taken, I wouldn't do a thing like that. But I know that there are certainly men who are keen. Uh, I'll just say that. Well, there's there's two men in the. In the, in the company, they're, they're very keen. Well, I mean, I mean, one of them's ten, ten years old. Yeah, I mean, but still, you can oh. tell that he's okay. But you're, you're really into me. But you're talking about Jimmy. Jimmy particularly oh. is just crazy about me. Oh. And does that does that oh. get awkward? Oh. Any it's funny? Mm. Oh. Mm. You're, oh, sorry. That's all right, Jimmy. Jimmy, that's fine. Hi, Jimmy. Jimmy. Yeah. Sure, yeah, it's fine. Okay. Yeah. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine, darling. I'm just doing my makeup. You sure? I mean, the scene we did, you didn't think anything was wrong with it? Nothing no. unusual? Did Did you mess up? I, I did I mess just... up? Yeah. Well, there's kind of that big bit about the you know latter half of the scene which you completely forgot and cut. And then, you know, went and completely what? quiet and started staring at the floor. And Whining. I mean, it's just weird. No, I'm not really. I'm not really with you. I don't. Not really do you with mean? me. Just, I've never seen anything like before. I mean, you, you just stopped. I mean, it's the middle of the scene. I mean, I was standing there like a. Uh, like a I mean, I'm sorry. I'm, I don't. I don't mean to have a go at you. I'm no, sorry, you know, I, know, I don't know. Harsh. It's just I, I, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. I think if you're talking about a, a choice that I made, to pause. A <laughs> choice. <laughs> yeah. Pause. I, I. It felt like about five minutes. I mean, you literally it, were just sometimes, no, like looking. Jimmy, at on stage, it can feel like a bit longer. But I mean that. I mean, if you're if you're reacting, acting is reacting. You know, and I, I you know, I'm. I'm so what do you I'm, call staring at the floor, and whining like a strange animal? What's that? Jimmy. I call it not knowing your lines, and leaving rather actor on stage, looking like a dick. You know. Hey, okay. Sorry, I know it's no, harsh. No, I'm sorry, no, I'm a bit cranky no. today, but I just really appreciate it if you could just do what we did in rehearsals and just, it's fine. you know, learn yeah. your lines. It's yeah. simple, okay? okay? It's not I'll learn my lines. a big deal. Okay, yeah. Right, thanks. Turn the fucking camera off. If you could just do her hair, Graham, that'd be really good. I've done it already. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but I can just do it no, cold, totally go over yeah. it again. The thing that'd I be want great. you to okay. understand, yeah. because does he know who I am? Okay, does he know? Because I... Well, no, 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 the thing is... Is it still honey? ...that I am probably going to be the highest grossing English actress this year. You know, so... I mean, I, I don't give a fuck that he's offered me a part in it. You know, I want the lead. 
And I Perfect. think he'll understand that. Ten out of ten. <laughs> I, don't, I don't care if he's won awards or, Part two. <laughs> or Oscars or, or whatever it is that he's won, because to be honest, you know, I'm Fanny. And does he know who I am? Oh, it must be, um, it's on that, sometimes it rings when I, um, Oh, no, mine does that When too. I'm on a phone call. Do you have a do you have a um, a partner at all, Graham? A partner, a yeah. girlfriend? No, not at the moment. Single, free and single. Girlfriend? Not at the moment. Are you? Okay, so you're not you you don't have no, a girlfriend. No, I don't have a girlfriend at the moment. Okay, great. So. Watch out, girls. <laughs> oh, whatever. Sure. Okay. Fanny, do you think it would be uh, it would be possible to ask you some some more personal questions now? Of growing up and your family. Okay. Sort of the Fanny not everyone sees. I see, yeah yeah definitely a bit of sort of my inner Fanny. I just. <clears throat> came from a, a very difficult background. Sorry. Um, I was very poor growing up. Mm. And um, my parents weren't really ever there. Mm, I had to raise myself. And my six brothers and sisters. It was very hard. Mm. Oh, there's shit in my eye. That's, you know what I mean? Because otherwise it's just, it doesn't look real. I'm so sorry. That's right. <laughs> it was really hard. But I think that actually that comes through now in my acting. And that is, that pain, I managed to channel it into something beautiful. <sighs> fat, fat, fat. That's, that's my gift. That's my gift that I give people. I'm incredibly serious about acting. Like, deadly. Sixties colour, <laughs> but it's terrific. Thank you look you. terrific. Thank you, thank you very much. much. You look really, you look good. Well, no one told me about how many people cried, but it's too late to say you're sorry. How would I know? Why should I care? Shark control, brilliant stuff. This it's quite expensive, but you know, it's brilliant and it really shows. Sometimes you a little bit of myself that. Um, you see, you see, my skin's grey anyway, mm. so you don't really notice it. Could I do? Do you want me to tell you the truth? Please don't bother trying to find her. She's not there. <laughs> Honestly, once it starts with me, the emotion just pours out continuously. And I've had directors say to me before that it's like nothing they've ever seen. Well, let me tell you about the way she looked, the way she acted. <laughs> How long have you uh, been acting, Jimmy? How long have I been acting? Active. Active? As an actor. <laughs>